तो जहां तक चंद्रयान थ्री मिशन के बारे में बात करें और जो कामयाबी से हासिल हुई है अब अगला जो मिशन है अब इसरो के बारे में हम हम बात करेंगे जो गगनयान वन है लेकिन अगर हम चंद्रयान थ्री जो उसकी कामयाबी अब गगनयान वन के लिए क्या वो उतना ही कामयाब हो पाएगा उसके बारे में बात कर लेते क्योंकि बताया जा रहा है कि जो सेम रॉकेट है जिससे चंद्रयान थ्री को लॉन्च किया गया था यानी कि एल वी बताया जा रहा है उसी का मॉडिफाइड वर्जन जो रॉकेट है वो इस्तेमाल किया जाएगा जहां पर भारत की जो पहली मैंड मिशन यानी कि गगनयान वन के लिए Now the successful launch of Chandrayaan has proved that the LVM3 is the most reliable heavy lift vehicle for ISRO but the challenges are also many as far as Gaganyaan 1 mission is also concerned. The Gaganyaan is a totally a different uh, so we need to have that uh, the, the the launch vehicle which launching the mission must have that human reliability the human relate, uh, rated uh, version should be there the second one is that uh, we need to create a conducive environment for the astronauts to when they are in the space so this uh, all together a new new lot of new technologies need to be uh, well suddenly it is going to be a very big uh, quantum jump as for the space program is concerned to provide Uh, not only the living space but the life support system the uh, protection against the radiation and above all safe return of the crew from space is are the very important technologies so once you demonstrate that we are in par with any other country today we are lagging behind uh, the uh, the america russia and china in this respect only the self reliance is very much okay For an independent country, a nation of this economic power, and so on. So, if we talk about Gaganyaan project that aims to demonstrate human spaceflight capability by launching three of those members to the moon, and these three crew members will be launched to an orbit of 400 kilometers for the mission, and will be brought back safely to Earth by landing in Indian waters. Now, under the mission, it is said that three crew members, who are in low Earth orbit, will be in unmanned flights, and one human spaceflight will be conducted. It will orbit around the Earth at an altitude of around 300 to 400 kilometers from the Earth for five to seven days. Now the space flight weighs around 8,200 kgs and is also being done at the cost of about 9,000 crores. अब इसी में ही अगर इस मिशन के बारे में बात करें और कामयाब अगर हो जाते हैं मिशन तो भारत चौथा देश बन जाएगा जहां तक अगर हम रूस चीन और यूनाइटेड स्टेट्स की बात करें जो अपना क्रूड स्पेसक्राफ्ट है उसे अगर स्पेस में भेजा जाए लेकिन ये बहुत ही अम्बिशियस मिशन होने वाला है क्योंकि चंद्रयान थ्री की वजह से और जो सफलता हाथ अभी हमारे वैज्ञानिकों को लगी है तो ये और ही बड़ी बूस्ट देती है जहां तक हमारे स्पेस प्रोजेक्ट और स्पेस पॉलिसी की बात करें तो आई थिंक दक्सेस ऑफ चंद्रयान थ्री इट रेज एवरीबडीज कॉन्फिडेंस राइट अराउंड वर्ल्ड बट इमेजिन the indian astronauts themselves that have already been selected and have been training imagine how they were looking at this mission to be able to see india successfully land on the moon which is one of the most complicated things that we ever try and do in space exploration the uh, the indians that are training to fly in space they're going to look at this as a really significant step in increased proven capability of just what isro and uh, and the indian nation can do